Welcome to the Friday night huddle. Emphasis on that last word. Huddling up was the only way to keep warm tonight. We'll get started in the Eastern District with the defending state champs. Maury taking on Norview. First possession of the game for the Pilots. They're running back. Ahmad Ashby escapes. It was an almost tackle. Turns into an all the way touchdown. 57 yards. Pilots on the board first. Now man in motion for Maury. That would be Amarian Granger gets the flip from the quarterback. Eric Gibson turns that into a score. The Commodores had a seven to six lead. It was a really big night for DeMonte Dunlap. Had over 200 yards rushing. This was one of three touchdowns on the night for him. And the Commodores roll 41 to 14. Kellum at Princess Anne. PA with the ball here. Short pass in the flat to Tyshawn Chapman. He can turn short ones into long ones really quickly. He's got skills. One of the best receivers in this area takes it a long way. That would set up a touchdown from the quarterback Ryan High on the quarterback keeper. Seven nothing Princess Anne. This was a tight Kellum uh, trying to pull off a big surprise here tonight. Their quarterback will park on the keeper picking up yards. This one would go to double overtime. I got another Kellum highlight for you here because they did so well. Jarrell Harrison not well enough. Princess Ann pulls it out in double overtime, 20 to 14. Bayside at Landstown. The Eagles with the ball here. Derek McMasters, the short pass to Davion Weeks. And Landstown was trailing just 13 to 12 in the third period in this game. But the quarterback for Bayside uh, with a nice pass, Aaron Williams to Tay John Reese. That was it was tough passing tonight because of the win. And here's a good example. Four interceptions for Bayside. This pick six from Damian Rodriguez Kirkland and the Marlins won it 27 to 12. Warwick against Heritage. Warwick with the inside handoff to Bryce Buchanan. Very elusive. And that would end up with a 26 yard touchdown and a 28 nothing Raiders lead. This was a relatively lopsided game. We have a block punt and a scoop and score situation. Marlon Wilson picks it up 35 nothing Raiders at this point. Fresh off a big win over at Woodside on Tuesday night. This is only their second game of the year. They look good tonight. Uh, and that was uh, Kaishan Jones with a pass from Eduardo Rios. Warwick won in a 35 nothing shutout. Jamestown against Warhill. For the Eagles, Tennyson Garrett up the middle, breaking tackles and some more tackles and then running free. Jamestown took a 7-0 lead, but we have a big surprise in this one. And not so much. Warhill would score the rest of the points in this game. Their quarterback, Shaheim Taylor, picking up some yards on the keeper. Then the rest of the game, they left it up to their defense. We got a Isaiah Hurlburt sh uh, showing here, and the Lions took it 39-7. to we have a theme on our scoreboard tonight. Ocean Lakes shut out Tallwood 43-0. Green Run shut out First Colonial 48-0. Lake Taylor didn't shut out Norcom, but won easily. Hickory got shut out by Grassfield 13-0. Indian River Great Bridge, Nansman River shut out Lakeland. And Tab shut out Pocosin 27-0.